Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. About a year ago, I let you know that Google was testing new homepage cards or widgets in Chrome Canary, which is an early preview version. And as I mentioned in that video, which will be linked down below in the end screen, homepage cards may be coming to Google Chrome. And then after I posted one or two videos on that, the feature just disappeared totally from the experimental version of the browser. Now, just to let you know that I have noticed today in Chrome Canary version 137, and when I posted those videos, that was back in Chrome Canary 124, 125. But in version 137, I have noticed today, if we head to our customized Chrome panel, we have cards that have returned, show cards, and there we go. And you can also continue with these tabs. So you get different cards, as an example, like you can get an Outlook card and you can have the option to continue with different tabs from your other browsers. So as an example, I'm currently signed into Chrome Canary on my other device, that's why I'm seeing this. So yeah, you can see um, I was busy with Wikipedia on the other device, obviously Brentech. So you've got a couple of options. So if we click on the three dotted menu, you can hide these tabs. Don't show continue with these tabs. And then about this card, which says you've seen tabs from other devices to help you easily get back to your most recent activity. You can manage settings from the card menu or see more options in Customize Chrome. Close that and then Customize Cards takes you directly back to the side panel where you can enable and disable those options. Now this is very similar to a feature as an example in Firefox called Firefox View where you can view tabs from other devices. This is quite a common feature um, in browsers so maybe that's why Google is thinking of bringing this into the browser. But at this stage I'm kind of on the fence with this one. I don't know if it's a feature I would ever use or not. But I'm going to leave it on in Chrome Canary, see what happens, see if it sticks around or see if I actually get some use out of it. But the good news is, obviously, if you don't want the clutter, because it does take up quite a lot of screen real estate and clutters uh, the browser. If you don't want that, you can just toggle that off. And then you've got that option at least. But I'll keep you posted. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.